District 13, where Democratic incumbent Joe Morrissey soundly defeated by former delegate Lasha Reese Ayer. Henry Graff joining us live from the state capitol. And Henry, it sounds like this race may have come down to a single issue. Kirk, good evening to you. Yeah, her campaign, La Charisse Ayers campaign, telling me directly after learning they won there that this whole campaign came down to really one issue, which was abortion. La Charisse Ayers toppling Joe Morrissey, getting 70% of the vote in this highly watched race. Air greeting a large group of supporters at a union hall this evening over in Highland Springs. Now, the former state delegate and mother of two spent most of her time on the campaign trail railing against her opponent, Joe Morrissey, who said he wouldn't support fewer abortion restrictions. The district covering portions of Enrico County all the way down to Petersburg, very diverse area in her speech. Holding back tears this evening, Air thanked her family and friends, adding her support for women's reproductive rights really got her to this point. This win is for my kids, it's for the kids and the families of this district, it's for the kids and the families across our commonwealth. They deserve to know that when you are on the right side, you can win. Meanwhile, Joe Morrissey now out of his job serving here in the Virginia State House. He conceded at an event this evening in Dinwiddie County where our cameras were. Morrissey is saying he will cherish his accomplishments while in office, but also looking forward to private life. It's been a great honor to serve in the Senate, and I think we've got a, a lot of things done. But I'm looking forward right now to being a full-time dad, coaching my kids in a myriad of sports, and uh, uh, and. That moving on to the next chapter in my life. Now back to Aird's win. Far from over at this point in time, she still has to run in the fall general election. She will have a Republican challenger, Eric Dietrich, for that seat. For now, we are live and on your side tonight here at the State Capitol Complex in downtown Richmond. I'm Henry Graff, NBC 12 News. Thank you, Henry. Now to the